Today's date is July 23rd, 2014. We're in the South Shelter. This is space 492. This is originally dug as a back unit or a back room to Jane Mellart's uh, Shrine 10. 490 is the unit that was dug above this in 2012. So when we started excavating this year on the 7th of July, we started at this line. You see a charcoal lens and underneath that, a distinct layer of plaster. As we took the unit down, subsequently we ran into the top of a wall that continues along the entire south edge. As we continued to take it down, which was essentially sterile fill, we eventually hit this cluster of clay balls, which is unit 21208. Based on the size, which is an average of 7.5 centimeters, it dates this level to level 8, for which we don't have or didn't have at the point any carbon-14 dates um, since Hodder started excavating here in 1992. Um, the 94, excuse me. Um, so you have five clay balls, one smaller one here within the cluster, one also embedded in the floor itself which is unit 20543. Um, the main objectives in this room were to remove the fill and to recover articulated bone for Alex Bayless's Bayesian Statistical Dating Program. So as we brought the floor down, just as we exposed these clay balls in association, we found three articulations, one set of vertebra that were about here, another set of vertebra that was here, and a bit deeper, about two centimeters below that, there was an articulated long bone that was fractured. So we recovered all of those, and she's using those currently for her Bayesian statistical dating program. After we uh, exposed a white plaster platform here, which connects to this platform, we also found a charcoal lens that was very shallow with a brim of burnt clay that went all the way around, which indicated to us that it was burned in situ, and that most likely it was a one-time event, which is perfect for Bayesian statistical dating. So we extracted that charcoal lens, and that will also be used, uh, essentially as a backup. And if we move farther towards the western wall here, we have a very large oven that was originally excavated in 2012. Now what we've done is take this all the way down to the floor, we're going to close this unit, We'll come back next year and excavate this, and we will retrieve most likely more charcoal and botanical remains that will again you know, further substantiate the dates for level eight within this building and in the south shelter. Um, and essentially, that's what this unit is.